Let's turn now to another story involving man's best friend, dogs. The Better Business Bureau is warning online shoppers about an increase in puppy scams during the holiday season. Families are paying hundreds of dollars for dogs they never receive. Reporter Katie Inman explains how you can avoid falling victim to the scams. Katie. Lewis, the Better Business Bureau launched a puppy scam investigation in 2017. Since then, the organization has seen an almost 40% increase in these scams being reported. The BBB says it's sometimes hard to distinguish what's real and fake, but it has tips you can follow. Searching for puppies to buy online starts out with a click, and when scammers are involved, ends with empty pockets. You know, puppies are a popular Christmas gift, right? And you ha you've never seen a puppy that's not cute. Scammers are tugging on shoppers' heartstrings with pictures of puppies and ads that turn out to be fake. They prey on the emotions, and they know you need something now in a short period of time, and they put the ads out there, you send the money, and the puppy doesn't exist. The Better Business Bureau says puppy scams have increased in the last couple of years. People right here in Knoxville claim to have given hundreds of dollars in hopes of getting a furry friend, but that's not the result in the end. I mean, you've spent your money, you don't get the puppy that you're expecting, and it's, it's, it's just heartbreak over, over and over. But there are some steps you can take to make sure you're getting what you pay for. One is making sure the pet actually exists. Really, you need to be able to see the puppy in person if possible. Do image searches for the pictures listed on those puppy sales sites. You may find that same exact picture on multiple websites because it's just a stock photo. Mm -hmm. That puppy doesn't exist. Never use gift cards or services like MoneyGram to send payment to pet sellers. So hopefully you can get them to accept a credit card because you have some recourse if you can do that. Overall, do your research and look for red flags that may be hidden on sales sites. You've got to just be careful and make sure that you know who you're dealing with. The Better Business Bureau says if you encounter a scam like this one, you can report it to their scam tracker online service. Lewis.